We're back for another Doka Nah Plan. <laughs> what to do with your boy Daffy? Today we're here with another tier list. Now, for those of you that uh, don't, uh, you know, watch Dokkan or play Dokkan, uh, leave. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm kidding. Please, please don't leave. Now, but here we have a, a tier list. Uh, so here I'm going to rank the top ten uh, TURs of uh, Dokkan. This is as of uh, LR uh, Prime Battle TM. Um, yeah, man. So let you know, let's just uh, let's just right into it. So number ten, I'm gonna put uh, Int Super Saiyan Broly. Now, Int Super Saiyan Broly, I will be the first to say, offensively, the first two turns he's, he's pretty mid. Uh, his attack stats you're normally about like a three point eight ish, three point like four range. Uh, somewhere, I, well, really, you're uh, like pushing like three million attack stats a lot of the time when he first starts the super, and you know. It, he does stack his attack a little slower, but the thing is, is that he has those built-in additionals. I have him somewhere. So, the thing about in Super Saiyan 3 Broly is he gives himself key, which is very strong for a TUR. He gives himself key in his 180% defense. Um, start of turn is actually pretty good. Now, he always has this built-in damage reduction and built-in crit chance. His crit chance, I'm not really too concerned about, but that built-in damage reduction is massive because when he starts to get those stacks in and later on events, you have, you know, uh, 400k defense, on top of damage reduction, and if you're fighting pure sand, you can get up to 36% damage reduction. That's massive. You were talking about uh, uh, maybe possibly 80, 90k damage shaved off, possibly even 100k shaved off. So that, that's very impressive. Uh, he has potential to quadruple super. I haven't really seen that. Um, I've seen it a couple times, but more often than not, he triple supers for me. Uh, and he always, he pretty much always double supers, but I've never seen him quadruple super that much. But he does have it in him. So I, I probably put him in at 10. Number nine, I'm putting, where is he? Dude, I, 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 I'm losing my mind. This The way this is built is awful because uh, it's including every single like premium muted so i have to i have to like scan my eyes all right so number nine we have uh tech ultimate gohan um i really don't need to explain this um greatly stacking with guard um he can get touched up uh those about first turns uh you know those first two turns he can be a a little uh squishy uh, especially in these red zone stages but so is broly also he has a lot uh better situation with as far as like partners go now uh than initially he was on release uh because that's saying lineage as well i believe i have him but yeah i mean i greatly said i mean here's the thing his kit's pretty basic but it's it's extremely strong i mean attack wise he's aged out unfortunately um I mean, Ultimate Gohan, you get like eight or so stacks that he can hit like six, seven. Like, it, it can't happen, but it takes a lot, a lot. Um, he doesn't have any built-in additionals either, which does kind of hurt, but not really because he's greatly stacking anyway. So really, if you do have a hidden potential system built for this guy, you want to go full additional. Uh, but you really don't want to lean to like crit or anything like that. You want to go as many, you want to have like 21 additional. So you can get those stacks in. Um, but pretty much after like f four or five stacks, he's really not taking damage from anything. Um, I mean, Omega would would go through, but, it, you know, it wouldn't kill him. Uh, he'd probably take about 400k, though. Uh, so, yep, took him Ultimate Gohan. I don't need to go too deep into that. All right, next we have this little dude. Uh, we have our boy, Kid Gohan. Now, Kid Gohan, his kid's interesting because that 58 uh k defense is strong dude my dude my laptop bro please please look this is so slow this is, this is painful okay so this th where is it if th that is massive three key at 58 percent defense i don't i don't care about attack uh, most characters nowadays are hitting a big attack stack i don't i don't really care about that attack stats not to say they don't mean anything anymore but Everybody can shoot out big defense, like big numbers attack wise, but not everybody can have big numbers defense. That's the key. Because if you can take those hits, you can survive. And then I can then put in my characters that have the unga bugga big damage, then we're cooking. You feel what I'm saying? That active skill. Active skill is fantastic as well. Uh, where is it? Uh, da, 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 yep. 30% uh, HP regen, guarding all attacks for one turn and raising allies defense by 20% for two turns. That is disgusting. Disgusting. Um, now his link set, it, it's okay. It's not the best. I mean, the innocence, demonic ways, gaze of respect. I mean, those three are dead links. D these are dead. Uh, same warrior race. I'm not a huge fan of that either. It's just attack, and his attack is pretty PP. He's pretty piss anyway. Um, but all in the family is massive as well as Satan lineage. Satan lineage is very uh, important as well uh, because it does give two key 
Um, he's not really going to struggle that much for can. He can, but it's not super bad. It's not, it's, it's okay. This is the wild wow, lag is killing me. Also, I'm not including easy ATURs in here as well. Um, I just, no. <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. Okay, so I'm probably going to get a little bit of heat for this if anybody watches the video. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna kill Kid Boo, and uh, but you, I well. Like, I think, like the thing is, is that like it, it, here, these two have a very similar problem where they can be very squishy. Turn one. No, I'm doing this. Never mind. I'm I'm doing this. Okay, I feel better about this now. Now, Kid Buu and Super Saiyan 3 Goku, uh, those they're both very impressive uh, in their own right. Uh, you know, Kid Buu, you have the regen, you have the active skill. Uh, he can build up very, very quickly. His main problem right now is lack of a 200% and lack of good partners as well. I mean, Buhan's good, but like in long events, and even so, long events, he does build up super, super, super slow. Um, with the 200%, I do think he'll be in pretty decent shape. Um, but, I mean, he's, he's two years old. You know, you really can't blame him. Type advantage, uh, he'd be fine in red zone. Uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, um, I have, I mean, I've seen this guy quadruple super, you know, triple crit a lot. Um, his transformation condition is a little inconsistent. Um, and like pre super, in, like in a Super Saiyan 2 form, he, he sucks uh, defensively. He's at like 180k. Like, he's, he's, getting, he's getting mopped up in, in most difficult content. Uh, pre super, uh, but that's pretty much all these units as well. So uh, you really can't blame him. Um, good partners, all that. It's just he's very basic. He just has the additional crits, um, but it, they're they're so high. It's such a high level offensively that you really can't blame him. All right, now next we have our boy uh, Majin Vegeta. Now Majin Vegeta, um, on release, I probably would have put like here ish, uh, but with the release of uh, these dudes, uh, he he shot he shot way up. Uh, because the thing about it is that you need a Trunks to get that thirty percent damage reduction. Um, but, you know, with the addition of the best LR in the game, it's not an issue. Uh, good link good link set. Um, he's hitting like 400, like 420 uh, defensive stats, uh, slot one. Uh, after post super, uh, pre super, he's not that high. Uh, he's usually about two something. But um, another problem I really have in Majin Vegeta is. His partners aren't the greatest, and also running two of him can be a little dangerous because he's so like key hungry. If you have two of him, and they both need six orbs, that's not uh, you're not in good shape really. So like having two on one rotation is very detrimental. It can get scary pretty quick. But he's good. Though. He is good though. Very good. Uh, active skill. I mean, super battle road. Sure. I mean, you can probably get that on turn three if you have like six attacks in slot one, which is very possible. But uh, yeah, uh, Super Saiyan uh, 2, Majin Vegeta, very good, very good. Uh, I feel like I'm missing somebody. No, I'm not. I'm not. Uh, I saw you would get that. We have the LR, uh, the, you know, the uh, Realm of, uh, Realm, Realm, I almost said Realm of F. Good lord, this video is a mess. Right here we have the ROF Blues. Um, they're pretty basic. Goku's pretty basic as well. Um, uh, offensively and defensively, the, he, Goku is pretty solid. I mean, he can get you know like you know eight, nine million attack stats turn two, and all that. Um, I think I have been pulled up. Right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, but yeah, I mean, look, like attack, attack, and defense, one hundred fifty percent, and like this, like it's it's fine. Like, it's just it's very very basic. There's no tech here. Like there's no damage reduction, no crits. Now Vegeta is different. Now, Vegeta Vegeta is a beast. Because Vegeta does have these crits and, and all that, as well as the defense. Um, Vegeta can be like 600, 700k. Goku can be like 400, 500 as well. Um, fully built up, but it's just it's just getting to that. Uh, Resurrection F and Super God Combat. These suck as links. I, I don't. I understand why they give it to him. It doesn't make it hurt any less, though, unfortunately. So, but they're they're, they're good. They're just basic. They're probably gonna age out pretty quick, unfortunately. Um, we did uh, get information that we're gonna get a new difficult event here um, from the producer's letter, uh, but I mean, give it like a year and a half or like a year. I don't, I, I don't know. Just unga bunga damage. Press. Like same thing with like Super Saiyan Three Goku. Lee has those like built-in additionals. You know what I mean? Like 
it's just, eh. It's just, eh. Eh. Yeah, I mean, not, not a lot of tech there. Um. All right, uh, who do I have next? All right, so next, so next I have, where is he? I have, I have Goku, the Goku Gohan exchange unit. Uh, Goku can get like 400K uh, post super. Um, That dodge is a very big part of his kit. I wish he had built in additionals as well so you could get him built up faster. Unfortunately, that's just not how he works, um, which sucks pretty bad. But I mean, what? Here's the thing. Once you trans transform into Gohan, you're you're in good shape. Uh, so you know he gets that attack and defense 108 percent. He raises defense on one turn. He stacks attack as well. Stacking attack, it it's cool. You know, yeah. It, the stacking attack doesn't do anything for me. You know what I mean? Because like the problem is, is that these bosses now they are their defense is obscene. So it's like cool. You're you're starting out with a four million attack stat. While, uh, you know, I, I need to go through a health bar, it's going to be like a 5 million damage or something. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it's crazy stuff like that. So, <clears throat> on Super Attack, he's raised it two times here. So, I mean, he needs to Super. He really can't sit in slot one. But Gohan can, though. Uh, he needs to evade, just uh, start building that up as well. Now, with Gohan, this guard... And him fully built up, he's sitting at like 600k, like 650k, probably even more, I believe, with guard. It's 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 ridiculous. And his damage, he, he's, he's no slouch damage wise either. He's, I've seen him at like eight, nine, you know what I mean? You can get him, you can get him as high as you want to because he sacks attack um, as Super Saiyan Goku, but it is, it, yeah. I mean, I don't really have an issue with this guy at all because he greatly, he greatly his attack as well. I just super a second. I have zero, zero issue with this. Uh, this going on. very good. Very nice unit. All right, here we got. Uh, next. Oh, wait. Oh, this is this is a mess. I'm. I'm gonna cheat. I'm. I'm going to cheat. It's my list. Cry. I don't care because I saw. I saw a glaring flaw. In my list. Um, Cell. I, I love Cell. I adore Cell. Uh, first form. He can. He can be. He's good. He's not bad like some people uh, claim he is. He's. He's not. He's not. You know anything bad? Why do I still have these tabs open? He's not bad. Uh, turn one or anything like that. But like attack. Like attack and defense thirty percent on super. Uh, as well as here. I mean, he's he's solid. Uh, if he's only facing one enemy, but like, dude, I've seen this guy like triple super, like triple crit. A lot in Super Battle Road. I mean, like, at second form cell, he's a beast too. But once you get here, like, they're not. There's not a lot that's like pushing this guy. I mean, like AOE Broly, he's hitting this guy for like 450. You know what I mean? Pre Super, but like post Super, AOE Broly isn't touching this guy really. I would imagine Bojack could do some damage to him, but I really can't see Bojack doing more than like 250, 300 post super from this guy. Because he can push like 800, 900k defense and like 10, 9 million attack stats. Like, you no, know, I like, eh, you know. And I think about like this Goku and this Cell, because they have pretty good partners. Um, this Cell, he got the easy A uh, physical Cell, uh, the physical LR Cell, uh, who's a uh, he's fairly solid. Um, and this guy, I mean, he's a Super Saiyan. He's always gonna have good partners. You know what I mean? Um, their partners are eh, pretty eh. He's got some good partners, but nothing crazy. I mean, when that easy, uh, when uh, Tech Majin Vegeta, when he easy A's, that's gonna be a crazy rotation. I hope they make Tech Majin Vegeta lean less on orbs because both these guys are orb hungry. But I mean, you know, it's gonna be it's, it's, it's gonna be pretty sick. That's number three. Uh, number three, I have. Where are they? Where? I'm losing my mind. I'm, I'm losing my mind. I, I can't think. I can't think. Bro, my eyeballs. That's stupid. There. Why are they right there? Oh, whatever. Uh, number three, you have the tech androids. Uh, tech androids. I mean, dude, their performance in the Broly fight is crazy. I have yet to uh, I have yet to beat Broly, um, but I mean I don't. I, I, the nullification is so crazy and it's free. The nullification's crazy. The Ghost Usher is it, it, crazy. Like 
AoE Broly is such a menace in this game. Like, he's hidden all units for like a 700k uh, attack. You feel what I'm saying? And they can just say, nope, no, no. They say, no, we're good. No, we're good. We're gonna have like 600k defense. No, sorry. No, no. Like, they, they are. I don't know. And they're not for a lack of partners. Their partners are pretty good as well. I mean, their partners are. You have like. 19 and 20. The cells work okay with them. Not the best, but they work okay. Uh, their leader skill is complete trash, though, unfortunately. The leader skill is pretty, pretty booty. Um, but, uh, yeah. Alright, next. Next, we, where's our where's our boy? Where's our where's our where's our gal? Alright, next next we have a uh, tech pan. A tech pan uh, it, it is crazy as well. And it's been a pretty big meme recently, but she has a pretty big hole. Uh, after she supers, uh, that first, like, one or two turns like she can get touched pretty quick uh pause uh but because she loses that damage reduction after she supers which is unfortunate um but i mean fully built up she's fine the thing is also this active skill as well like she's dropping a nuclear bomb on broly like because she's greatly stacking attack the entire time so you could have like a nine like a 9.5 million text that then like and like next turn drop an active skill and you're uh, there's They'll live, but you're shaving off like two, three health bars. You feel what I'm saying? Like, hey, it, it gets ridiculous. Um, you know, and the the fifty nine percent chance to crit. Um, I mean, the, the unit super attacks. They don't. They're not super crazy. I mean, this is like super battle road. I mean, which is good. I mean, you know, you know, you know uh, the stun chance and, and all that. Her partners, though. I mean, they're not the greatest. I mean, like the you know the Int, uh, GT trio. I mean, they're they're good. They're very they're very powerful. I mean, I throw them in slot one though. Uh, unfortunately, I mean she is designed to be in slot one, but like if she takes a super in slot two, I've seen that sin. I, that sin is that like th that strength sin, the STR sin is so crazy. Like I swear, he will just super you slot one, and there's nothing you can do about. It. There's not a lot of units in the game that can just take that. I, I, he gets like 800k. Like he's not. Omega Shenra is not a joke uh, in the red zone. Um, but I mean, her her, like, her link set's good as well. She's not gonna have the Videl problem. She like 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 look all in the family, saying lineage. These two automatically make her very good. GT, I mean, look how strong GT is now. I mean, Battlefield Diva, Innocence, sure. Who who really cares? I mean, that's really just for like running a Peppy Gals build. You, like, you could run our Videl's team, but like you're not running. Anywhere nowadays, I mean, you could probably run Videl on some red zone stages. Maybe I, I, I might do that. I, I might just take red uh, Videl into like some of the earlier red zone stages. See how she, see, how he, see how she performs. But I don't know. I mean, Kame, Kame High and a Fierce Battle. I mean, ugh, no shit. Um, but Pan, very good, very, very good, very strong. Um, but then we gotta go to my goat. Where's where's my goat at? Where, where's where's my where's my where's my number one? Where's my number one? Where is he, bro? I find him. What? What is this? What the? Bro, what? Where is he? What in the world? Did I already put him somewhere? Am I tripping? Oh, it's I'm, I was looking for the I was looking for the his his regular form. I was looking for base Ginyu. Now we have Ginyu at number one. Now the thing about Ginyu at number one, a lot of different factors. Ginyu has more tech than Pan does because uh, he has the Scouter, the Heal. His partners are fantastic. Rakuma and Goldo probably still I would no nah, they're the best banner unit in the game. Uh, I mean guard with like 600 700k defense for free basically. You're not touching that. I mean, uh, Burger and Jace, they ain't no slap. They ain't no slouches either. I mean, they can they can push like 500k with dodge, bro. Like they're they're very good. You have the physical Ginyu Force, very strong LR. You have the uh, tech uh, Ginyu Force, very strong as well. Uh, Ginyu's partners are disgusting. Uh, Ginyu's partners are pee on pans pretty hard, I would say. Except the GT trio, but like, eh. that Ginyu's gonna age like fine wine. Ginyu's team is gonna age like fine wine. Uh, tech uh, pans. Pan's gonna be the best, you know, you know, on her team for a very long time. But 
I don't know, man. I just, I can't see. I really can't see Pan's team overtaking Ginyu's. I, I, I can't. I mean, you have, you know, Super Saiyan 4 is another, but like, what what tech you got? Like, all these Ginyu Force units are like supporting each other. You feel what I'm saying? You can point out like weak holes like Tech Goldo and like STR Jace, but I mean, they get covered up by so much of everything else. Like, Ginyu like stacks, Ginyu stacks defense so fast and he triple supers left and right in base that you transform into, into you know, uh, Goku Ginyu. It's, it, it's game over. GG. You know what I'm saying? Like, Truth is like, has like screenshots of like Ginyu had like a million defense in the Broly fight. You know what I mean? Like they're not. Like, no one. No one's touching getting you. I, I don't think so. I, I definitely don't think so. Oh uh, yeah, this is my list. Um, nothing. I don't think there's anything super obscene. I don't really think I'm missing anybody. I think I put you too low. I, I did put you too low, huh? Here, let me put you. Put him right here. Put him. Put him right here. I'm kidding. Right, it's just so bad. He comes out on global tonight. Um. I'm not, no, please don't summon for love of God. Do not summon for Raditz. He is so bad. <laughs> it's actually, it's actually a joke how bad Raditz is. Uh, I don't think there's been a worse unit on release. Let me look through this. Has there been a unit that's been worse on release since Raditz? I wouldn't even say you on release were bad because you at least have the stuns. No. No. I mean, maybe STR Kefla. I remember, I, I just simply remember STR Kefla could get touched up in some of those, you know, uh, Legendary Goku events. Like, I remember that. But she wasn't, like, god awful. She's aged out. All, uh, pretty much all of these 2020 units aged out quickly. It t says 2019 units, but. Yeah. Uh, uh, not. Maybe AGL Bardock, maybe? that would be a whole separate video. Maybe you too. I remember you being pretty ass on release as well. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Animations are fire, but he's a god awful unit. But uh, yeah, man, this is my list. Uh, let me know what you guys think, man. Uh, I'm very curious to see what you guys think. Um, did you like the list? Did you hate it? If not, I, I really don't care. I'll be. I'm probably gonna end up making some more uh, tier list content. I have another one uh, planned. I'm gonna do pretty soon. But I have to actually get up early. I have a dentist appointment. I'm not looking forward to it um but yeah it's been your boy daffy guys thank you guys so much for watching this video if you like the video make sure you like the video subscribe all that good stuff and yeah it's been your boy daffy guys now we'll see you next video peace